When making a newsletter or something that you have to send out on a regular basis, having something to go by, like a template, can make your life a whole lot easier. Here to show us just how to do that is Tammy Sears at OnSiteComputerTraining.com. Tammy, it's good to have you here. Thanks for I know we're supposed, to go to the, we're supposed to go to the fair, yeah. but it's a little wet, so we decided to bring it indoors That's today. A little warmer and drier. Yeah, and I was just going to ask you resumes, and we're talking about templates on the computer, which yes. I think is great. It yeah. is. From resumes to newsletters to flyers to promotions for your business, um, there's a plethora of free, plethora, that's a big word. Uh, is a there's a plethora of free resources for us, and one of the ones I wanted to show us, and today we're kind of talking about newsletters, but we're going to just cover resumes as well. And you did say we have a joke, that you have a oh, joke. Oh, Do you okay. want to get that to that now or later? later? Here's a joke. If you guys can email and tell me this is funny, it's not funny, email your own jokes, and maybe if they'll make the cut, they'll be on TV. Yeah, 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 that's okay. cool. Okay, here's a joke. Okay. A woman called, oh, a woman customer called the Canon help desk with a problem with her printer. Mm -hmm. And the tech support says, are you running it under Windows? And she says, no, my desk is next to the door. Ma ha! ha. <laughs> we got it! <laughs> I kind of knew where that one was going. That's pretty darn funny. High okay. five. High five. High five. I got All it. Right. Awesome. Okay. okay, moving on to the newsletter template. <laughs> Now, if you have Microsoft Word, which most of us do, or Microsoft Publisher on your computer, you may not realize it, but you have an open door to a lot of free templates to help you get a newsletter or a resume or all sorts of things kicked off. What we want to show you first is in Microsoft Word, I have downloaded a free template from Microsoft.com, and just like to show this to the viewers. Mm -hmm. I grabbed this this morning, and um, it's, it's a basically a four-page flyer. Uh, sorry, four-page mm -hmm. newsletter, and I was able to customize it. You can see here where we have the date, and there's, oh, there's Monica's Monica name. Monica's name, okay. And if we click back one, and then there's Alex's name. Oh. You can customize anywhere in your newsletter, um, and it already throws in some suggested photos and suggested text boxes to help you organize your newsletter. Now, I'm going to do a little preview to give you an idea what this looks like, and the idea is you grab something that's already existing, and then you just customize it so you don't have to do all the work yourself. For those of us that don't have creativity, I can barely match my clothes, much less <laughs> throw together a newsletter. So if we look at page two, it's going to go down just a second. The idea is the place settings are there. You just click in and you customize. Put whatever you want in this area. You can talk about certain headlines for your business and certain, you know, late events and things like that. And page three is just another example of layout. So this is already done for you. You just get to click and play and add your own stuff. Isn't that great? Can you do that? Can you click in it? And, yes. And in any of the objects. Yeah. Let me just go ahead and close the print preview. Okay. And now we're back on the first page. And if I want to customize this, mm -hmm. in fact, I put this here, I could just delete the text that it came with mm -hmm. and then type and in then right whatever right. I want. I love it. To love customize. It. So this is just Microsoft Word. Yeah. And I went on to Microsoft.com and downloaded this. And I'll show you one in um, Publisher. Then we'll show you on Microsoft where you can find these templates. This is Publisher. Some people have this software. Some people don't. If you do have it, again, you can download free templates. You can plug in your own information anywhere on this template. Make it. In fact, you can create it so interesting that people won't even recognize you started with the template because wow. you could change these pictures into your own pictures and make this your own text, change the color layout, and so on. Now, here's where I found these templates, Microsoft.com. Once you go to their main website, just type in the word templates. Mm -hmm. And everything we see here from new resume samples is always changing, always being updated, all the way down to agendas, award mm -hmm. certificates, brochures, business cards, calendar, anything you could think of. It's you all can right run there. You can all right there. Just click and you pick. just click and pick. That's good. Huh. Click and pick. <laughs> whatever. So if we were wanting to do a new resume sample, yeah. uh, we just click on the resume sample, and then it will upload a whole bunch of different options that you can use to create your own resume administrative, and, and it even gives you suggestions on how to do some of the wording. No kidding. Yeah. Because a lot of times right. that's what's so difficult about putting together a resume. It is. Like, where do you start? Where do you start yeah. and how do you word it? And the idea is you don't have to start with a blank piece of paper. That's and then cool. once we, it is, and once we have put together our custom, whether it's a resume or whatever, and this example is a newsletter, you can actually use Outlook to push this newsletter through to all of your customers that are in your Outlook contact. That's the power of it. And then you can actually just email it if you don't want to print them all out. E email yeah. it. You can hard copy print and mail it, put it in the mail. And if we have time, I wanted to show one last way of doing kind of an email marketing that's not Microsoft-based because some people don't always want to use Microsoft. we got about 20 seconds. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Right, ConstantContact.com. Very, very common. Look in your inbox. You probably received a newsletter from somebody mm -hmm. in the last few weeks. Go all the way down to the bottom right-hand side. You'll probably see it's from Constant Contact. You pay a little bit where your Microsoft stuff is free. You're doing it all your own. 
Constant Contact gives you some tools and allows you to send out to a bigger broadcast of people without having to get any panties. Contact, contact, yeah. Great. I love it. I love all this uh, free, easy stuff. I appreciate it. It is great. Thank you so much, Bobby. And thank you for joining us, everyone. We will see you again tomorrow. Have a great day. Stay tuned for the news at noon. Bye-bye.